Like any newlyweds, Phyllis Lyon and Del Martin, surrounded by family and friends, cut their wedding cake and celebrated their first moments as a married couple. We're very happy and we're very grateful for all of you coming. The women, both in their 80s and together for more than 50 years, were married in a closed-door ceremony at City Hall by San Francisco Mayor Gavin Newsom. <laughs> Two extraordinary people that have lived extraordinary lives, that have spent the greater part of a half century fighting for justice. The women are among thousands of gay couples from around the country and in California saying their I do's. In 2004, Newsom challenged California's marriage law by allowing some 4,000 couples to marry at City Hall. Although those marriages were overturned, the move resulted in a fierce legal battle with some two dozen same-sex couples suing the state for the right to marry. Last month, the state Supreme Court ruled in their favor, overturning the ban on gay marriage. Supporters cheered the decision, but conservative groups have vowed to fight the ruling. We believe that redefining marriage to include same-sex couples undermines the essence of what marriage is. Still, brides and brides and grooms and grooms say they won't let anything spoil their big day. I now Stephanie Stanton, NBC News. San Francisco. In San Francisco and other cities across California, same-sex couples are planning to declare their marital vows to each other with the state's blessing. We're getting ready. That's an announcement we've prepared for our big day. Thousands of gay couples from around the country and in California are gearing up for the most important day of their lives. We are running around like crazy. Uh, we've got lists longer than we know what to do with uh, things yet to do. Among those getting married, 84-year-old Phyllis Lyon and her partner of 55 years, 87-year-old Del Martin. San Francisco Mayor Gavin Newsom will be officiating. It's a pretty powerful day. and. Uh, you know, it's just again, at the end of the day, it's about people. In 2004, Newsom challenged California's marriage law by allowing some 4,000 gay couples to marry at City Hall. Although those marriages were overturned, the move resulted in a fierce legal battle that ultimately led to last month's 4-3 to three state Supreme Court decision to overturn the ban on gay marriage. Supporters of gay marriage cheered the decision, but conservative groups vowed to fight the ruling. We believe that redefining marriage to include same-sex couples undermines the essence of what marriage is. Still, brides and brides and grooms and grooms say they won't let anything spoil their big day. I now pronounce you Stephanie Stanton, NBC News, San Francisco.